interesting compared to last year's, Ryan. Uh, you know, at first I didn't really like this layout. The, the high speed entry, you know, followed by the decel into the first turn where you really have to power out of it, uh, seemed to favor the higher horsepower cars, whereas last year the course was a little bit more mellow and leveled the playing field a bit more. But, you know, as we're seeing right now, it makes for some epic tandem, so I have no complaints. We saw Dai Yoshara sliding into your view right there, getting those tires warmed up, getting ready for battle. I know the judges look like they're just about ready. So again, this is a one more time battle between Dai Yoshara and Ryan Turk. The winner goes to the final four. The loser goes to the grandstands. We're gonna be underway in just a few moments. Double check a couple things, get a couple GoPros in line. I think, Kato, I think you're cheering for Ryan just because of the first name commonality. And we just heard the uh, shout from Chief Stewart Doug, send the car. So here we go on initiation, Ryan Turk starting up. 76.8 miles an hour from Turk. Sliding through that transition hard on the brakes. Dyershar stays on his door, coming in tight. Coming around that clipping point, they're staying close to each other. This is again, another great chase run from Dyershar, another great lead run from Ryan Turk. It's very hard to distinguish these guys. It looked like Ryan Turk might have learned something from his first run. He was able to create a little bit of a gap on Dye in that last turn. Yeah. So we're going back to the replay. Ryan had some good angle there on initiation. Again, this is a natural area for both cars to slow down. Ryan sucks. Ryan uh, runs his lead run. Dye Ochara sucks in close and stays close to him the rest of the run. This is uh, tough to judge. Kato, is there anything that stood out to you about those runs? Well, that was a really clean run, so uh, both drivers threw it down. We're going to have to see how the second run pans out. So the car is going to switch. You'll see Dai leading. Again, Dai qualified 14th, Ryan Turek qualified 11th. We've got Chris Forsberg who qualified 10th, who's already in the final four. Justin Pollock who qualified 9th in the final four. Daigo Saito qualified 12th, so no driver higher than 9th place qualifier is still left in this event. Pretty amazing. So you'll see cars taken off from the line. Ryan Turk's going to lead. Dai, no, Dai, your car is going to lead. 78.8 miles an hour on initiation. Transition back in front of the judges' stand. Turk sucking in slow. Lots of smoke from, from Dai Yoshihara. Turk, hard to see through. Staying pretty close. You know, I don't think. On that follow run, I don't think Turk was as close to Dai as Dai was to Turk, but overall I didn't see any major mistakes from both drivers. Again, Kato, what, how are you leading? Do you think you, ha you have a winner or do you think we might go one more time again? Overall, I'd say those are two really clean runs. Uh, not a very clear winner, but it, Ryan Turk did seem to be a little bit farther in proximity compared to Dai Yoshihara in his chase run. And also I noticed he went one tire off track, sprayed some dirt over here on this uh, first outer zone, so we'll see how the judges take that into consideration. I'm trying to peek over the judge's shoulder so I can see who's voting for what. Looks like they're asking for another replay of the first run. Ryan Letang asked to see a replay of the first run when Ryan Turk was leading. So here we go again. Turk leading. Dai is hard on him. Again, I think I think Dai is closer through that big sweeper section than Turk was to Dai. But again, no major mistakes. It's hard to to see anything that stands out as being a winner. 
I see Andy Yen's decision. I see Ryan Latane's decision. Huh. I think if this was a battle of who had more cameras on their car, Ryan Turk would win. So Ryan Latang voted for Die. Andy Yen voted for one more time. Tiebreak is going to be Brian Eggert who vote for Dai Yoshihara. So Dai Yoshihara is going to get the win. Dai Yoshihara is able to move on past Ryan Turk. 